Good afternoon, this is Paul. Um, I've got a very special car today. This is a car that we've seen before, a car that we've known most of his life, and, and it's a car I've photographed before, but not in such bright sunshine. Um, being a dark metallic colour, the sunshine I'll show you in a second is going to help me show you what the car actually looks like. Um, it's a 2014 Porsche GT3 Club Sport, and I'd like to show you around. So this is the car. The colour is called Anthracite. Now there are a lot of white and orange and black and all sorts of other colour Porsche GT3s, but not many in this colour. And I'm going to walk around the car, and as you see, it's got quite a low sun. As I walk around the car, you'll see what effect the sunlight has on the metallic in, in the paintwork. So as we come to the side that's facing away from the sun, it actually does look quite dark. But what you can actually see here is, is because you've got reflection in the metallic, you can see the shape of the car. And unlike the, the newer 911s that have the, or the, 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 the new GT3 RSs that have the extra vents in the front wings and what have you that make the car look really, really aggressive, this is actually a very pure shape. So you've got uninterrupted lines all the way down the side of the car. You've got great big wide rear wheel arches and with uninterrupted lines. And it's, <laughs> this is one of my favorite Porsche GT3s, it's lovely. You've got a nice big lower lip spoiler at the front and it's got a that is actually sacrificial so that will come off should you damage it but this car was spec actually specified with um, a front suspension lifter so sleeping policemen high curbs that sort of thing don't necessarily need, need to be an issue now just looking around the car now I'm just going to come into this paintwork just trying to give you a sense of the colour. It's kind of grey with a bit of mocha, but you can see how metallic it is, it's lovely. And set off against these black wheels and the red calipers, it's just a really special thing to look at. And um, the red detailing actually extends to the inside of the car as well. I'll show you. So what we have here is have the black interior. You've got the GT3 Alcantara steering wheel that you can see there, nice and grippy. Um, and you've got the gear change paddles, change down on the left, change up on the right. And you've got this lovely stitched leather. So it's black stitched leather all across the top of the dash, all across the top of the doors and through the Alcantara. So you've got black and Alcantara with this red contrast stitching which goes really really well ties in nicely with the with the brake calipers on top of that you've got the gt3 insignias embossed on the head restraints and these lovely gars red seat belts so it really looks nice and if i just pop the seat forward it's not a fixed carbon bucket which although they're they're very supportive um they can be quite rigid these move and are actually incredibly comfortable and of course what they do is they expose this roll cage at the back now these cars are very strong and sturdy and they're quite rigid anyway but with the addition of this cage that makes as well as giving you a rollover protection that actually gives the car a bit more rigidity and then you've got the nice gt3 insignia on the transmission panel so it's thoughtfully specified i think You've got a place to put your phone and a charger. You've got this lovely carbon fiber interior trim. You've got the uh, front suspension lifter button there, the sports exhaust, um, the PDK sport and what have you for your, um, for your, for your um, sports chrono. More carbon fiber here. And you can see it's lovely condition. All the leather's in nice condition. And if I just show you the mileage there is 17845. So the although we didn't supply it to the first owner, we have supplied the car since. And the the people that we supplied to are not the the type who have been down to the track every weekend um, <laughs> driving the wheels off it. They're more people who've um, 
I like to take them out on a weekend, park them outside their favourite restaurant. So it's actually, it's all the time that we've known it, had a rather nice life. And it's got a full Porsche history. It's one of the cars, it's one of the early cars that had the engine replacement. So the engine was replaced and was warranted either to 2021 or 2022. Check on the advert and it'll tell you. Um, but this one also has a Porsche warranty well into 2021. So it's a nice car all round and it's a very interesting car. So I hope you like it. If you'd like to know more about the car, please look at our website, www.clinkardcars.co.uk. And if you'd like to talk to us about it, please pop us an email, pick up the phone, send us a text, send us a WhatsApp, and we'd be very pleased to talk to you about it. Thank you very much for watching.